and out for our walk. That's still yet another wet and gloomy day in Wales. I don't know if you can hear the water, there's quite a fast river down there. This is the walk we do two or three times a week. So yeah, let's start updating you on the uh, very predictable Welsh weather. But I personally haven't known it rained so much. I mean, we got to Wales in October and I think maybe we've had one fine day a week since then. And then it's been spattering and then it's been torrential. But there you go, that's why we have beautiful green fields. And this has led us up to the Afon by Fon, I think it's called. Quite swollen because of the rain. I don't know where its usual boundaries are, but you can see that it's up. But it's lovely, it's lovely around here. It's really nice. <laughs> Time for Lorna to do a little bit of reminiscing today then because uh, we've come back down to Black Rock Sands. Oh, as I think I've said before, I've spent loads of holidays up here since I was a tiny child um, and Black Rock Sands being one of the beaches we came to. But I always remember down, I don't know exactly where it was, but it was around by the rocks when the tide was right out. And we've got old family cine film and my brother is about three in a little red anorak running along and then jumping into a puddle which actually came up to his <laughs> and he was Stick there was this Ghibli red style. anorak floating in the thing oh, I'll never forget it it was like, you've so been coming funny. here since you was a little girl haven't you oh, since I was about 18 months old I think yeah. let's yeah. give him a kick oh you dickhead we've got Ready? lots of micro lights behind us making a buzz yeah loads of micro lights flying behind us which is a uh, very unusual. Great place for them to take off here, though, isn't it? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> so, yeah. So that's where we are at the moment. You can see the tide's nice and calm. You want to go in the water, chance? The boy. Look at that water. It's gorgeous. The glistening on it. We were going to say that we're probably, this is our last bit of filming, until we reach Anglesey on Monday. Yeah. We've had a really good time. Yeah, it's been lovely and they've been really good. Yeah, they have, yeah. So we will say a fond farewell until the next time. <laughs> and we'll see you in Anglesey at uh, Rossid uh, CL. On Monday. On uh, Monday. And we're just outside the village of Ben Hletch on Anglesey. And what a lovely little site this is. You can cut the grass, look. <laughs> there we are. The tent up. We're the only ones here, which is marvellous, so plenty of room to park the car. There's an actual dog walk. I can go around that field, I think, which is cool. But also I can come off of here and apparently there's, I can walk for miles pretty much anywhere I want anyway. This one's got really nice toilets. And shower, shower's a pound to go. Take you up and have a quick look. Oh, this is really nice though. We booked here for a week, but the lady said, We've got no more bookings at the moment, so if we want to stay longer, which I expect we probably will stay two weeks here. Look, there's a washing machine available. So, we have 
Really nice toilet there. Okay. So we've got our own little gas heater, so we can bring that over if we want. And then we have a really nice shower. And here, yeah, it's a pound to go. She says washing machine available. Ring Liz for the key. So I might find out about that. And then down the back here's the the Elson. Let me empty the loo toilet cassette. Very nice sight. I don't know what that is, but it looks like it might be a router. I lost Steve. Anyway, I was just finishing getting set up. So, catch you later. Oh, good afternoon. We have made it to Anglesey, but what I wanted to do, unfortunately, when we got here, it was absolutely beautiful, bright sunshine, and we've set all up in the sunshine. Now it's gone all cloudy. Now I've got the camera, but I just wanted to show you. This is Ross Sid. Look at this. All got your own benches. I've just dumped Betty there for a moment. Uh, we've gone on this pitch. Pitches are, a couple of them are a little bit slopey, so you will want um, chocks to come in. Uh, we've obviously been using the blocks and the uh, self-leveling, but yeah, Lorne has been in and filmed the uh, toilets and the showers are amazing. But what a beautiful little site though. And uh, all we need to do is we're gonna have to borrow their Wi-Fi up there. I don't know the password. So I'm going to uh, see if we can get it off there in a bit. But I don't know, just, just up there is a big caravan, so a little bit of a tight road to come in, but not too bad. And uh, yeah, just, oh, and uh, the owner's name is Liz. And uh, I didn't catch the husband's name, but it was him that I spoke to. And uh, no bother if we want to stay here longer. Uh, this one's £20 a night. Um, you've got a dog walk just up over there. But it's just such a beautiful night. And what friendly, lovely people. Really nice. Brilliant water pressure. And uh, each uh, pitch has got a drain on it. Unfortunately, my hoses won't reach. Uh, they're about a foot short. But that's not a problem. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you before, in case it starts to rain and and everything else, just a beautiful sight. There's some sheep in this field here that were all out when we turned up. I liked the look of this one when I saw it on the app and uh, it looked really good. I don't know, we got all nicely set up. This is our little pitch, all nicely set up. So I thought I'd uh, show you it before, <laughs> before it all gets dirty and ruined and all the rest of it. But yeah, well, Really pleased, actually. The van is filthy, though. Look at this. Yeah. That's going to have to get a wash during the week. But I get the impression that it wouldn't be a problem for us to wash the van here. They're just so friendly and stuff, as they all have been, I've got to say. I haven't met any real bad people at all yet on this journey of ours. So, uh, anyway, we I've got to go in and sort out all the uh, gear and stuff. It's got some big news coming in a day or so. Um, I've bought a new camera, so I'll show you that. But I've got to wait till I can pick it up from Argos. Um, what else is new? Yeah, bought a new camera, so that should help things. Um, oh, and uh, yeah, I don't know what's going to happen about Wi-Fi at the moment because our van Wi-Fi non-existent. But it does look like their their Wi-Fi. It's uh, able to pick up if we get the password but whether that's enough to upload videos or not I don't know so we might have to wait a little while for these to happen but, oh, come back out sunshine where are you we don't want that cool <laughs> see you soon still working Anything come down here since no. here. The only car that's come down is hers. Yeah. So, <laughs> all good. Look, Chance. He's got a door in public. 
<laughs> He's been good actually, hasn't he? Yeah. I think he likes it here. <coughs> so. Yeah, no, good. All good. Anyway, let's uh, carry on getting sorted and uh, we'll be done. Brilliant stuff. See you soon. See you later. Okay, first morning walking, Ben Fletch on Anglesey. I've just come down there and the campsite is up to the, as you're seeing it to the right, about half a mile. So I've come down here as a signpost to the local church and there's lots of woody areas. That we can see if we can explore. But Google Maps is showing lots of places with potential for our morning walks chance, eh? Hey? Blooming cold this morning, eh? say that much. But yeah, let's nice walk. See if we can catch some more in a bit. Okay, we've walked just under a mile through this glorious countryside. Apparently there's red squirrels here to keep my eyes open. And church up here. Oh, if I do this every day, do a two mile walk. And very pleasant it is too. And if we come to the church, Tiny, tiny church. Oh, excuse my puffing. I'm not going to go in today. I'm going to save that when I come up with Steve. Tiny little place. It's lovely. Very old. Should we make this our stopping point? Our turnaround point? For the next week, we're going to stay here a couple of weeks, so more exploring to do. Brilliant. Have a nice day, everyone. Stay warm, stay safe. Good morning. God, it's freezing. Uh, first day, first full day here in Anglesey, in uh, Ben Clech, if I've said that right. Ben Clech, not Clech. Okay, and uh, the important stuff today, we gotta go shopping. Yeah, we're gonna go down to a place called Clan Gefney. That sounds about right. And uh, down to a supermarket there. And uh, yeah, should all be good. God, it's really cold. I'm loving this site though. Loving this site. Loving this site. Yes. Oh, it is lovely. Proper lovely. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend my coin for sure. Be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. I just wanna feel alive. It's just what I do when I'm out. So try not to hold me down, feel alive. Car. Look at the state of that car. It needs a good wash. Bloody filthy. Isn't it Chancey baby? But personally, oh, yeah, yes, no. she holds a fair bit, doesn't she? Good old B. Good old B. And that was there. Quite painless really. 
150 quid lighter and quite painless. Just spotted this over there, look. Caravan and camping supply shop up here. Not that we need anything, but handy if we do. Before we go anywhere, what are we looking for? Oh yeah. We uh, sorted out the problem with the Wi-Fi. We're using the uh, Camps Wi-Fi, which is quite good actually. Um, but for some reason, Lorna's Kindle won't pick it up. So we're just doing that because we've got no phone signal or no van Wi-Fi whatsoever. But we have got um, the campsite Wi-Fi. But I say, so. Updating your opinion. Well, yeah, no, it's no problem. Anyway, so while Lorna chooses some more books, I would choose about 10 if I were you. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're probably just today going to go and put all this shopping away and have a chill and work out. We've got to do some uh, planning ahead for uh, March because we know where we need to be in March. So we've got to go and get the laptop out. Sorry, get the laptop out and uh, work out where, whether we can be down there for that. 